Lot number 112 is a 2016 Dodge Caravan with 93,000 original miles. This vehicle has been running for over an hour. AC is blowing ice cold. Motor sounds good, running nice and smooth. The paint looks good. It's got minor scratches and little chips here and there. Let me show you what I see. I see a scrape right here on the bumper. I see the grill out of alignment. You can see that this uh, the bumper is separated from the chrome little grill. There's a scrape on the bumper. The motor sounds good. Listen. Sounds good. The AC is blowing cold. One of the headlamps is uh, full of water. The other one is nice and dry. Condensation, better said. I saw something here that caught my attention was that there was water in the back. I pulled out the seat from the storage because that's a storage and there's water in here. So I just spoke to the, to the BSO fleet director and he explained to me that this vehicle was parked in an area where we had those three days of rain that the water came up and it filled this up with water. So. I didn't see any uh, signs of water anywhere else, only in the trunk area where these seats, they go into the bin, into the storage bin. So the vehicle runs and drives fine. It's not a flood vehicle. All the rest is nice and dry. It's just, that's the lower area of the, of the vehicle. So as you can see, these seats were stored in there and they're all moldy and dirty and stained and wet. So if you, you know, these stowaways, you can hide the seats underground. So these vehicles are pretty low to the ground and the water accumulated there. So we're gonna sell it like it is. It runs and drives good. I drove it in the parking lot. It rides great. It's got a check engine light on, but that could be a whole bunch of little, could be a many things, but the motor sounds good. When I rev it up, I'll show you. Let me show you the rest of the car. The dash is nice. It's got a nice radio. AC is blowing cold. The seats are nice. No rips, no tears. The back seat, the center seat are nice. They fold down as well. That's pretty cool how they fold down to the ground. All right, the headliner looks good. The AC is blowing cold. It's got the floor mats. The door panels look nice. The motor sounds good. The door is open and closed properly. I noticed that the rear tail lamps right here is chipped. Over here as well on the passenger side is chipped. But uh, I would have never known about this if I wasn't going to pull out the rear seat and I didn't know about this. I just found out about this water accumulation here, but it runs and drives good. Like I said, it's been running for over an hour. All right, and there was some black ants that were in there that came out. So black ants are not, they're okay. As long as they're not red, I'm fine. All right, the door panels look good. The seats, like I said, the interior looks nice. It's a good looking van. The only issue I see is that eventually you gotta get someone to clean it and detail it and get that water out. All right, it is a clean title. It's not considered a flood vehicle. It's just that water is deposited in the back and we're gonna sell it like it is. All righty, good luck.